You know, the vast majority of the men that I speak to on a weekly basis tell me that it's the nighttime. It's the evening when they're most vulnerable, most susceptible at relapsing and returning back to pornography. So in today's video, men, what I'm going to do is I'm going to give you the perfect evening routine. The evening routine that I've used for three and a half plus years now to stay 100% porn free. In the evening routine that I think is going to set you up for success, not in just removing porn, but most importantly into stepping a life that you know you're created to live. But before we do that, guys, remind you real quick who we are and what we do here. My name is Frank Rich, CEO, founder, and head coach at Rebuilt Recovery, and it is our mission to help men become better men by quitting porn and rebuilding their lives. And if you want to know how in the last two plus years, we've helped over 3,000 men begin to claim back control of their life, then down there in the first pinned comment below, I'm going to put a link to our free ebook. It's a seven-step guide to living life without porn. So after today's video, guys, if you haven't done so yet, make sure to visit that page and download the book. And I want to give you guys this evening routine. And like I said, this is the exact routine that I've modified and tweaked over these last couple of years. But the foundation, the principles here have stayed exactly the same. And I believe that if you follow and execute this, not only will your issues and struggles with pornography late on in the evening begin to fade away, but by doing this, by being intentional about how you wind down your day and set yourself up for success the following day, not only will you kick your habit with pornography, but the fruits of what you're doing will produce a life that you could never possibly imagine. And that's what we provide you here is we're not just a company that is dedicating you or dedicated to helping you overcome pornography. We're dedicating at, we're dedicated to helping you become the man that you were meant to be. And in doing so, we help you in removing your struggles with pornography. So I think the first thing we need to do in the evening, men, is we need to establish our bedtime. We need to actually know, okay, in order to set myself up for success tomorrow, what time do I need to wake up tomorrow? And then reverse engineer that based upon the amount of hours of sleep that you need for optimal recovery. I can't tell you what that number is. For some people, it's five and a half. For some people, it's six. Other people need eight, eight and a half hours. So you have to play with these numbers a little bit. But you got to get clear on what time does your night need to end and stick to that. We talk a lot about the confidence building is keeping the promises that we make to ourselves. What we got to learn is begin to make those small little promises. What time am I waking up? And then based on that wake up time, what time do I have to go to bed? So first establish the, the wind down bedtime. Then from there, the first step in this evening routine is one hour prior to that bedtime, you need a reverse alarm clock. You need an alarm clock that's going to signal you, trigger you to execute on these habits. So when we understand that habits require a trigger, we have to create an external trigger for ourselves. And I think the best thing to do that is have one hour before your bedtime, have an alarm clock that goes off. And this signals to you that you need to now begin to execute on the evening routine. Once that, once that one hour alarm clock goes off, the first thing I recommend doing is reviewing and recapping the day that you're currently in. This is a part of our program, so the men here within Reboot Recovery will understand this, but we want to spend some time thinking about what we've been thinking about throughout the day. This is called our evening reflection journey. Evening reflection journaling. So what we want to go through here is where were our eyes wandering? Where were our thought patterns not fully aligned with who it is we're trying to be? And in doing so, getting clear on that, how could we have corrected that? This is the intentionality at which we need to begin to ask ourselves the proper questions, and those questions will produce the proper thoughts that we're trying to live our life through. So once that alarm clock goes off one hour before the bed, you need to recap and review the previous, um, yeah, the previous day, the day that you're currently in. Secondly, is shut off all devices, phones, laptops, computer screens, televisions. Try to dim the lights in your home, if at all possible. So you wanna create this environment with minimal blue light. Understanding blue light is signaling that it's still daytime. And if we have struggles, if we have trouble with going to sleep at night, what we need to do then is provide, create an environment that's gonna keep us healthy. Create an environment that's gonna set us up for success. Create an environment that's gonna create a calming sense for us to operate from. So we have a one hour shutdown time. Once that first alarm clock goes off, we then review and recap the day that we're currently in. We then shut off all devices, lights, dim the lights, use candlelight if, all, if, 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 if at all possible. Uh, shut off the devices, shut off the tablets, shut off the phone, shut off the television. And then the third step here in this routine is to plan the next day. Okay, so we reviewed our previous day, but what are we looking forward to tomorrow? What do we need to keep doing tomorrow to remain porn-free? And what, 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 what must we avoid 
getting into? What choices and decisions? What content should we avoid consuming? What things do we need to get done? So this is a very intentional plan, but once again, it starts by establishing your wake up time. Once you have a wake up time, reverse engineer it based upon the amount of hours that you need to sleep. Once you have that bedtime, one hour prior to that, there should be an alarm clock that triggers you to execute the rest of this plan. Once you that alarm clock goes off, review the previous day, review the thought patterns, review the good things that happened, and make the corrections for the improper actions that you took. Secondly, shut off all devices, pick up a book, read a book. You don't need content, you don't need to be consuming social media, television, uh, anything. So shut all that off, dim the lights, and then thirdly is plan out the next day. Guys, I really hope this video helped you. If it did, drop a comment down there below. Like I said at the beginning of the video, if you're new here, make sure to download the seven step guide. Guys, we literally walk you through the exact process that we've used with over 3,000 men to provide them the tools to take back control of their life, quit porn, reboot their brain, but most importantly, seven a life that they know they were created to live. Frank Rich, we're Reboot Recovery. I love you guys. We'll see you on the other side.